A long-standing maritime border dispute between Lebanon and Israel may be close to being resolved. A written proposal is now on the table. It's based on years of intermittent and indirect negotiations mediated by the United States. A deal would be a rare diplomatic breakthrough between enemies that would unlock valuable underwater resources but it would also position the Eastern Mediterranean as an energy hub supplying Europe as it seeks replacements for Russian gas. There is a need that has been created uh, due to the Russian-Ukrainian war. Europe is looking at the East Mediterranean as one possible source. Israel is already an exporter of energy and wants to significantly add to its output by starting to produce gas at its Karish field. But there are security concerns. The Iranian-backed armed group Hezbollah has said it has the capability to obstruct the sale of gas to Europe if Lebanon's rights in the maritime region aren't recognized. Israel dismissed the threats and warned of a war if there is any attack. But despite the tough talk, all parties have shown readiness to reach a deal. Lebanese officials and Hezbollah have called it a historic opportunity for the country grappling with a major financial crisis. Lebanon hasn't been able to begin drilling because international companies won't explore the area until the border dispute is resolved. The proposed compromise is believed to involve including Karish Field in Israel's economic zone, while most of the nearby Kana will go to Lebanon, even though there are no proven reserves in that field. Lebanon said that it's getting everything it wanted, so the negotiations are on line 23, and that Kana basically will be exploited by Lebanon without going into the details of that kind of uh, prospect. Uh, Israel is not very clear what is getting in the uh, in this deal, is it, is there, are they getting uh, security and uh, security guarantees? Are they getting any guarantees that they're not, not going to be any attacks from the, Israel, from the Hezbollah? Israel is expected to receive a copy of the written offer in the coming days. The agreement won't become formal until the parties finalize it during indirect meetings at a UN base near their border. A breakthrough doesn't signal peace or a normalization of relations, but it could reduce tensions and allow gas to flow from under the sea. Zenachudar Al Jazeera, Beirut.